are quick to judge and slow to understand and stand under constant scrutiny till we be afraid to be ourselves. Constantly apologizing for who and what we are. Never giving ourselves permission to be free, freely walking into slavery as we lie foundation over perfectly finished structures. Lengthen our lashes with L'Oreal and clinch our cleave with secrets. Secretly suffering, selling us as truth until the door closes and you hear yourself crying. Cause every orifice in your body is full except your thoracic cavity. And cavities can't compliment smiles smeared on with lipstick and lipstick to sell it with wicked words that are contrary to actions, actualizing thoughts and though they be blatant, we prefer to perceive the words as truth. Emotional hypochondriacs obsessed with instability and instability feel discomfort, comforting our hypochondria so we move like HPV, infecting everything we touch until hearsay is Catholic scripture. Here. Say the scripture till you believe it. To keep your position as Pharisee, you fall in false prophecy and pharmaceutically be generic. So we OD just to fill it. To authenticate placebo for the plague that's plaguing your cerebral with semblance of self. But mirrors make no myths and wisdom's vision is x-ray, toxic to the flesh. Producing cancerous candor that only few of us catch and live with while others remove it through chemo because they can't stand the judgment. You want them to be the epitome of perfection, perfectly purchasing humanity on credit whose interest rate is too high, so it's unobtainable, obtaining your permission to be human when it's not yours to give. The day you take dust, blow breath, and make live is the day that I give that power to you. We struggle to earn the approval of man who ain't no more than man. Soak soil, soil in my soul with sectarian scores of sacrament, sanction, and cycle slavery and these rights. Can't write wrongs that I write with right hands in the stars but we seek them like divine intervention a walking contronym and constant contention with self contending sincerity of speech and then forging the signature with sharpies marking a permanent impression further impressing that you ain't got no sovereignty to reign over me I be meteorologists changing cumulonimbus into stratus strategically stretching you beyond comfort to expose the reality of expose and we stay disconnected like unpaid phone bills atoning for the skin on our skeletons that stay locked in closets dreaming emancipation emancipating dry tears on tears unfit for men. We crave elevation and then we tear down